Hello everybody, Hooded Cobra Commander 788 here, and this is a quick look, not a full review, but a quick look at one of my favorite G.I. Joe action figures from 1983. This is G.I. Joe's Marine, Gung Ho. This was a pretty special figure in 1983. In that year, G.I. Joe branched out from its overwhelming green color scheme, and the more colorful figures from that year really stood out. Gung Ho's overall color scheme is in a light blue. He has a green camouflage pattern on the lower half of the figure. He has gray boots and bare arms and an open vest so you can see his bare chest and that reveals this blue Marine Corps emblem tattoo. He also has his green Marine Corps utility cover. As a kid I was really fascinated by all of the details on this figure. It was very unusual looking. Gung Ho included two accessories, the first one being his grenade launcher in a dark gray plastic, almost black. It looks really good and it has a strap. It was unusual to have weapons with straps back in 1983. His other accessory was his backpack, his very large backpack that was in the same light blue plastic color as the figure. This is a good time to talk about one of the problems with the Gung Ho action figure and other action figures with light colored plastic. They tend to yellow over time, which changes the light blue color to more of a green color. This is inevitable for figures with light colored plastic plastic. There are ways to slow it down. There are ways to temporarily reverse it, but it will happen to any action figure of this era with light colored plastic. It's caused by the flame retarded compounds they put in the plastic, which breaks down over time and discolors. This gung ho is still not too bad. It's still mostly light blue, but it has taken on a slightly greenish tint to the light blue plastic over the last few years. It's still not a bad example. I've seen a much worse. Gung Ho, of course, included a file card. I've always liked the artwork on this file card. I just think that looks great, and he's a very colorful character. That was a very brief overview of Gung Ho. I do have a full review of this figure on my channel. I hope you will check that out. Make sure you follow this channel for vintage G.I. Joe toy reviews. I have a huge back catalog, and there are more coming. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time, and until then, remember, only G.I. Joe is G.I. Joe.